Okay, welcome back. Now that we've done some light shading on this and we've built softly, now we can start to pick out areas that are, they're not the, they're not the darkest mid-tones, but they are mid-tones. So in this area, it's the lightest it's going to be. These are a little bit lighter because I've got a light source coming from over here, but then it starts to change in this area. So I'm just going to come in here and I'm shading in the direction of the bottle because it's got the wood grains. So sometimes I'm left-handed, so sometimes I turn the paper. And I'm sure most of you people um, that have drawn know this, but for you that are just learning, um, you know, you'll find that certain things don't always work for the same people. So sometimes I've heard, don't turn your paper, and other people, you know, draw upside down. So, and so anyway. This area, since the light source is coming from my right, it's making the middle of the bottle a little bit darker because it's getting, it's starting to get a shadow. And so these are the beginnings of the midtones. Okay. And I can actually do that across the bottle because there's a certain part of the bottle that actually gets darker. Okay, and same thing, if you notice on the seal where this uh, glare gets really light, it gets really dark over here, but I can pick that up by doing a mid-tone to the, to the left of where the glare is and just come in here and do a mid-tone. And there's a highlight on there, come under here. And these are some of the mid-tones in this still life drawing.